Welcome back everyone Crowgen here with another episode of Man of Benamp. So we are on our third part of the series so far and we are going to continue where we left off. We just spoke to that, is he like a shrink? I don't know. But the pirates are taking us to this creepy ghost ship which looks like it's surface from the water and we've just been crashing into it and then yeah that's where we're up to. I didn't expect all these little jump scares but this has been quite fun so far so we are just going to carry on and see where we're up to. Abandoned World War II freighter. Alright, we're docking up to it this time, we're not crashing in. And there's a little ladder going up to a door. Do we really want to go in there though? This looks creepy as hell. Junior, you retire la tête à l'image. What is that? Go. It's a bit of a jump that way, isn't it? He's not giving him no shoes. Walking on a rusty metal boat with no feet, no shoes on his feet. You just see one of them handles being rusty and snapping off when you jump to it. Jesus. Uh, nope, no thanks. Was this the room before where where we started and oh, we could have shot our mate but didn't? Oh, we need to walk. <laughs> I was too busy watching what everyone was doing. A little sister waiting for us, though. We got something there to check. What's this? Guard duty. Hey. Well, that way, nice. Stay back. Stay back. Oh. <laughs> I pressed down because we were facing the other way and he's just turned us around. Okay, let's go. This whole place is a floating death trap. We could do with the torch, you know. So it looks like you've got to go right here, stopping us going left, isn't he? This number three, is that the third floor? These guys aren't messing around, are they? What the hell was that? Oh! I did not sign up for a trip to Creep Town. <laughs> and me so neither. This place is making my hair stick up so far it's gonna jump out of my neck. I like the way the stuff glows up when you can, when you've got it there, like that, like that, like that. Miller. What the hell do these dickheads want with us? Who knows? They just want the treasure, don't they? They want the money. We go, hang on, before we go there, I want to, no, it's just a wall, just a wall, carry on. Oh shit! Oh, rats. Something there. Nearly missed that one. International memorandum. Fourteenth Division Army. You're covering Patterson's guard duties tomorrow. He's sick again. Conveniently, it's always when he has guard duty. So hold in hold three A. First is twenty four hundred. Check char for ratio, uh, rotation. Secret found again. This is the third time this week. None of us like it down here. Maybe Patterson should book up. Just get on with it. 
So it's a bit creepy down here and people don't want to do it. Hang on. Is that a... That looked like... Oh, no. No. I thought there was another little passageway there. Awesome. You're in both to see. Okay. All of you. Into the room. Into the room. I just got shivers hey, and goosebumps. It's piss black in here. Give us the light. Oh. And he did as well. Thanks. I didn't expect that, you know. Have we got a torch too? Let's turn that on. If it works. It does. It's got a bit of oil left in it, maybe. Fucking place. Uh, an abandoned Given ship. Given our observations that this is some sort of ship and seems to be abandoned, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's some sort of abandoned Psh. ship. No shit, Sherlock. You gonna write a book about it? Give him a break, Fliss. He needs one. Achievements unlocked. If you're selling, I'm buying. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. Yeah. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. Second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. Yeah, a proven. It's dangerous yeah, man. here. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. They swiped our distributor cap. Gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. What's a distributor cap? I don't so, know. Okay, what exactly is a distributor cap? Now pretend you're talking to someone who doesn't know anything about boats. Well, typically, a distributor cap is designed to distribute voltage from the coil to the correct rotor, which in turn... It's an essential part of the engine. We're not taking the Duke of Milan anywhere without it. While so those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. We have humorous. Okay. Liz, I just wanted to say that, um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me? I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe, you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys or whatever. But I, I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us. So, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. <laughs> well, I, mm, well, your apology is kind of accepted. Kind of? Cool. Cool. Wall's a little bit rotted, but we might be able to pull this out the way. Oh, it's a vent. That's one way we could possibly go. It's a bit early to be escaping the room, though. I want to check it. All right, while he's looking at that, let's go and have a look around a little bit, see if we can find anything important. Can't really see over there. Oh, something to check though. What's that? Real, oh, glasses. Real creepy. I thought that was coins. You can tell they're old, right? Boss, man. What's the plan? Hey, keep your eyes peeled for another. Uh, something else there. Opportunity. What do you think this ship was? All right, what do we got here? Miss J. Riviera, apartment uh, 2275 Lockwood Drive, Crescent Springs, Kentucky. Hi, baby doll. I miss you like crazy. Three months until my next leave and jumping into your arms. Three months. I've been on some shore leave with the guys, had a few beers, but don't worry, I'm keeping everything ready for you if you catch me drift. How's work? I hope the boss of yours is leaving you alone. I know you can take care of yourself, but I feel helpless being so far away, and I want to keep you safe. Great. Of all the places I'm going to die on, a bona fide ghost ship. I get a lot of time to think while guarding the cargo holds. It's dark and spooky down there. Some of the other guys have seen a figure roaming around, but I've always got, I've always got you to keep me, to keep me safe too. I'll be with you soon and get a job as a mechanic 
and then we can get married and have two children. We'll be happy together forever. Love you so much, Miller. Right. Oh, something there as well. Someone been trying to scratch the way out. This was ripped off. It's a dog. Can we pick up this? No. Thought we might be able to carry the torch down so we can see a little bit. Alright, we can look at the door. Someone sounds scared. Don't know what to say. Right, let's go and see what this does. Any luck? I can't get it open. Hey, come here. She's got a little nail file clipper thing, hasn't she? Or if she's still got it. If we can bust it open, freedom. Maybe. Oh, 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 we don't know where a vet like this would go. Eh, uh, can't be worse. Wherever it leads, it can't be worse than here. You want me to just smash through this wall? Oh yeah, sure. Big man on campus. See you later. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Yeah, okay. Conrad, you do it. Shades updated. Uh, distract. Hey! Yeah, you, Long John Silver and shit? Well, what are you guys doing out there? Pieces of eight and shiver me timbers, you one legged fuck faces! Yeah, you smarmy farmers! <laughs> is he trying to get them to come in? I'm gonna rip your pirate parents off your shoulders and stomp them into rainbow colored stew! Hey, hey. I'm warning you. I am an American citizen. You really want my yeah. president coming yeah. after you guys? Because he will. You. Each and every one of you, personally. Very, very personally. We can need to go hey. quick. Can and we need to pull that cabinet back across, maybe. You. Hello? Can we pull that cabinet across? Um, replace it, replace it, pull it back. What's all the screaming? Well, we got away. Are we safe now? Sailor girl. Look at that. I love what the demo plays. Come on. There's got to be some stairs around here. There's got to be a way out. Oh, wrong way. Oh, there's a door to check. But that means... Oh, we can actually go in this one. What's this? It just looks like rags. And then there's the noises of an old ship are so creepy. <laughs> oh, God. Nothing in there. We've done that for nothing. It scared the life out of me for nothing. That's it, nothing. Now we're by ourselves. Oh, who's she? I just want to know where the hell they all went. There should have been dozens of people on board. Hundreds. How could they all just vanish? There's another room to check. Leave all of their stuff behind. Alright, what's this? 
Where's the you are here arrow? Cargo hold two is out of bounds. I was just going to say, who shut that door? Oh, and why did that fall off the wall? I'm going, I'm going. Is there two ways to go here? We're going to go left. Nothing there. It look like there's anything in this room. Let's go. Let's right, try that way first. You hear that? If by that you mean that. Oh, I cut him off halfway through. What are we looking at? This place is fucking massive. It's a big ship. I can see that from the outside. So I, I want to kind of check the other way. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want it. I don't want to go the wrong way and miss something. If that makes sense. Well, we can't go there. It looks like a way forward. All right. So that's where he is. We're, I'm going to go and check the other direction first because there was another place to look. If I can get through it. There we go. Oh, there's nothing even there. It was a dead end after all that. Right, let's go. Oh, he's going to end up with... something on his feet. Is anything just here? Anything? Oh, yeah, there's something there. A diary? Is that a diary or a book? Don't know. Let's, get, let's open it and see. Looks like a diary, doesn't it? I, had, I identified problem areas with the structural brittleness and cracks in some of the sections of cargo hold one. I instructed our shipwright to carry out the necessary welding repairs. I advised the captain to go easy, especially in bad weather. Any aggressive movement could cause the ship to break its back. I responded to a complaint that some electronic equipment had been malfunctioning recently. I discovered growths of tin whiskers around some of the components. I cleaned and added lead to the solders, which has stopped the equipment shorting out and sh uh, should slow down the growth. Secret I found. I conducted a thorough weekly engine room inspection of fuel, oil and fluid which showed lower levels of cylinder oil than expected. I have reminded staff that in the engine room to be attentive and vigilant with their hourly checks and to alert an engineer if there's any loss of pressure. The ship was caught in a heavy electrical storm which began to short which began shortly after midnight. The lightning strikes caused a lot of electrical arcing, travelling through the hoisting cables, a loft deck which has left damage. The grease has boiled up and destroyed some of the cabling. I've received reports that the main problems caused by the storm are electrical equipment at the moment. It's likely the tin whiskers haven't helped matters. Despite the rough sea, there have been no reports of any structural damage. However, I'll have to work through the night to make a full damage assessment. Okay, so that's it. An electrical storm has caused havoc on the ship. Let's go and see where the others went. Was that one of them then? Yeah. Something on the table. What's this? It's a little tiny skull. That's like a rat, a rat head. And we got another book. So, the first one was like the engineer. It's a long one as well. The skipper has KO'd the booze for this whole goddamn trip. There's nothing like being sober to make you realise just how quiet this ship is. There was a fight between those dumb schmucks, Wilson and Anderson, right after we sailed, but Ferris nipped that in the bud real quick. And it's been quiet as a church ever since. 
I got talking with this. I got talking with a fella who'd help load up the ship. He told me they put a bunch of coffins on board, which isn't so weird, maybe. He said that there was some guy who'd made the coffins were all put in one of the holds, just right, real precise. Not the treatment you'd get if you were any old grunt. It's got me thinking who could be in those boxes. Booze was a bum lost, Perez said. He felt drunk after four cups, but I said he was talking baloney. It was like ditch water. Perez said they made some hooch from some supplies they lifted. Meeting up later, down on six to check it out. Just heard one of the guys here snuck a look at the boxes. Gonna find him and see what he saw. Maybe he can even help me in to take a look. It's all set. He reckons he can sneak me in. We're gonna go and take a look tonight. Secret found. It's all off. The guy who was gonna help me get in the hold has been signed off sick. Doc Finley thinks it's some kind of thinks he's some kind of flake, which might be true. But Miller says it's something else. Something weird about that place. Miller, Miller's kind of a twitcher. Wouldn't want to be caught in a pinch with him. That's for sure. Perez said that the boys made more hooch. Too bummed out. Too bummed out to sneak and get try some. But what else is there to do? New batch is worse than the last one. Never listened to any damn fool idea from Perez again. Last night I was on duty with Wallowich. Wallowich. And goddamn, if he didn't creep me out, he got spooked and started babbling about some sergeant called Jones that went missing in action in the jungle. Reckon that Jones and his crew were the ones in the boxes travelling home, just like us saps. I sneaked a look at Jesus. I sneaked a look at Jesus. I sneaked a look at Jesus. There it was. Just like the guy in the port said, all laid out real nice and glory all over each one. It, if it's Jones in there, they've done him proud. Good old Uncle Sam wouldn't leave any of us out there. He'd make sure we all come back. Right. Anything else down this way? We can go over to the right a little bit, I think, as well. Down that side of the bunks. Something there. Oh, that's one of them pictures. Oh, what was that? That looked like a monster. And the girl was looking through the window. Premonition unlocked. Alright, so we've been all around this way, yeah? Let's go through that door where they went. Where am I going? Am I stuck? Oh, that way, that way. Not on that boxes, no. Keep going. Push forward. Two of them have got no shoes on. Three of them, is that? Three of them all barefoot on this rusty metal. I think I see something moving down there. Something moving over there. Gotta keep our heads down. Yeah. There's someone down there overhead. Shh. Everyone quiet. Lights off, good idea. Gotta be careful taking a drink in case we've got to press a button quick. What is that? Oh, that's the thing off the boat. That's what we need to start the boat. Look. It's the distributor cap from the Duke. Distributor cap. Now's our chance. Now's our chance. Grab it. You can't watch my back. What do you think I've been doing? Okay. Shades updated. Genuine. That's a long way down, that you know. Especially with no shoes on. Ooh. She's gonna have to hide. Why is he going down as well? Oh my god, will you wait? Holy crap. 
Is hij gewoon weg? Ehm. Uh, gewoon een fles. Oh no. Don't get caught, don't get caught, don't get caught. Come here. Uh, why did she run for it? God damn it, they're taking bliss. Shut the fuck up, man. Where are the others? He knows where they're down now. X, Y, A, B. X, Y, A, B. I've got to remember these letters, just in case. Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. Divert, divert, eh, de stacht, de stacht, de stacht. Didn't work. All right, I see you. Come on, step out. Stand over there with her. Well, this hasn't gone to the plan. This really didn't go to plan, that was bad. I think I made all the wrong decisions there. We were following them. We gotta keep our distance. This way we can get ahead of them. Let's hope it's faster. I got this. Main deck, June 21st. Find a way off, off the ship and find the others. Right, this is a... Uh, I, I can't see a thing. I know we got a torch, but the camera angle's weird. There we go, we've got something to read. What's with the makeshift chapel? Oh good god, why do I need why to Why did we just it? put it back down? Pick it up. I wanna read it. Need to keep hold of our the right button, I think. Okay, to all crew, Area 7C has been converted to a temporary chapel of rest for the duration of the voyage. All crew are required to be silent and respectful respectful when passing near 7 7C. Signed, Chaplin. Nothing on the back? Okay. Is that something on the wall we can look at too? No, we can't get over there. Alright, looks like nothing really in this place. Let's go. There's a lot of creepy noises on this place. Can't go down there. Is that the passageway? Is it? Hang on, I want to check. It might be, it might be blocked by boxes. Yeah, we can't go down there. Creepy noise. Just one way to go. So yeah, if you're enjoying this and you are still watching, don't forget to like and subscribe. Really help me out a lot. And we're stuck. Where's the door? <laughs> Can't get out. Right, we got to come back. There we go. Wait a minute. We've been here before. Uh, Have we? I don't think so. Oh, I swear we've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? Come on, guys. We gotta keep moving. I don't recognize it myself. Just gotta check around there, you know. Just wait for me, please. Don't wanna be left on my own. It's scary. Yeah, there's something there. 
Don't be nothing in there. Don't be nothing in there. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Alex, what is it? It's nothing. Nothing. You don't want to know. What? What does that mean? Why did you say that? Me? Why did you say you don't want to know? You should have just said nothing. Hey, according to this, today is beef casserole. Mm, yummy. Why is it? This is secret. Is everything just ground to a halt on this one day. The whole ship just stopped functioning. Yep. Okay. Hang on, I want to check something there, because that... That had a down... Oh, no, it didn't. That was as far as it goes. Hey, right, we've not been over this side yet. So there is something there. Oh, a knife. Nice. Are we going to take it or just leave it? Hey, easy with that. We shouldn't be screwing around right now. Nice you blade. Could make a nice severance package for my assailants if you catch my drift. We might need it. I guess you never know. We might have to Ooh. use it. Did you see that? There was like loads of little butterflies went flying past the screen then. It was that like a bad decision? Can I, yeah, we can. We can. Okay, so we are coming down this far end. Through the door and moving on to the next place. It's just right, one creepy room place? after another. I'm thinking we gotta go through here. Something on the wall there. That looks like one of them pictures. Oh, he, he's get stabbed. Cut off your jib. Okay. So we've got to be careful that our mate doesn't get stabbed. Now, so we've got to make a decision. Maybe that knife was the decision that gets him stabbed. Wait. This isn't right. What do you mean it isn't right? <gasps> oh, God! What? what? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you... I mean, did you hear anything? Yeah, I heard me screaming. <laughs> I know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. Uh, probably just rats. Rats. Probably just rats. Oh. That's all it was. Don't fucking laugh at me. Now she's annoyed. All right, we've been here before. I'm sure of it. We're going around in circles. Well, what do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. It all looks the same. That's why. We don't have a lot of options. It's got to be this way. Oh, what was that? Okay. Something flashed no, up. This isn't working for me. What? Gross caskets and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know? Nope. Uh, no such thing as ghosts. You're right. It's gross and it's crappy. Got to get out of here too sweet. And we got to find Fliss. Okay, so can we just get the fuck out then? This is like a big open room. Look at the dust under our feet when we're walking, that's creepy as well. What is this? Don't know, but we can go and look at the coffins. Should we? Should we? Is this a bad choice? Hey. Brian Carter. Who's this guy? And what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. So we got one casket nameplate. Let's go and have a look at the others. What's the scratches on there? There's two people in there. <gasps> look at this. It's insane. Is it even human? Is that like... Was it ever human? What is the deal with this place? That is some bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now. Oh, leave, uh, leave, leave. Getting shivers. Alright, we got two more to check and Yeah, two more to check. What's this Look one? At this one. Like for a kid or something. I don't wanna know. Let's get out of here. 
Yes, maybe that's little baby Dracula. <laughs> baby right Dracula. There. Those are his parents, and they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And, and then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> <laughs> last one, last one. Got some serious locks in these Oh, that one's locked up. You don't want them getting out. Why would they be chained and locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. Maybe he was alive when he went in. Has something over there. Do I want to open this? Uh, it's a rat. Oh, she good. What is it? Look. What? <laughs> Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? It's getting me to death, that. Right, nothing we can do with that. It's just a, a jar. Okay. Let's get out of this place. Don't like that room. No way there. I know I'm checking different ways and stuff, but I'm most of them are no good. Roger that. We gotta get Fliss. No it's a weird little passageway, this. What the hell is making that sound? What sound? What sound did she say? She not heard that. So spick and span. Spick and Spam, is was this clean? That creepy music? Do Any I want medicine we find in here oh. is gonna be old. Way out of date. Why would we Why want you? medicine? Okay, so it's just a little bottle. Still might have some kick. Four years of med school, and you prescribe me an 80 year old aspirin to call me in the morning. Aspirin? That's not gonna make him sick, is it? Alright, nothing else in there. Let's have a little look around then. Oh, look at them on the bed. Ah! This is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. <laughs> I can't take it. She's all hearts, isn't she? Why are you gonna touch him? Oh, what the fuck? Don't touch it. Why did you touch it? Right, we're not gonna look at him no more. Can we go that way, no? Nope, dead end. What happened? Connie! Oh, is he just vanished? Connie, where the are fuck we... are you? What's going on? Where is Conrad? He must have gone on ahead. Connie! Hey, Conrad! Oh, this is creepy. Where the hell did he go? His anxious state's just gone up. Oh shit. This looks so cool. Where are you taking me? I was just gonna say why is the three of them and how come they're walking around, but they're getting taken somewhere. Okay. Lower deck workshop. Find a way to escape and find the others. Tell me where we are going, damn it! Where do we stop then? Right, 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 let's just keep going, keep going. Oh, there's something there to check. Hang on, hang on, let me back. Come on. Wait, 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 wait. Something there. Oh, a wrench. Do oh. Hey, take off. Leave that alone. I didn't want to get him stabbed because do you remember? The vision we seen. Are you ready? Ready for what? I thought if we get the wrench, he'll stop us. 
and then get stabbed. It's all about the decisions, maybe. Stop. He's getting creeped out as well now. I'm not the only one. So I have bought a House of Ashes and I bought um, Little Hope. So they will be coming after this is done as well. I haven't bought the latest one yet. I, I forgot what that one's called. But yeah, there's a lot more to come on the channel. It's a little bit slower sometimes than my main one. Come out. Show yourself. He's dead. What are you looking the gunner? Has he got a bag over his head? Damn it! No, that is just bags. <laughs> he thought it was a person hiding. These fucking places cursed. Yeah, you're not wrong. Not wrong. And a hat. Look at oh, this. what was that? NG Madan. Did you hear that? Yeah, that then that was like um, someone breathing through a oxygen tank. What was that noise? What noise? Olsen! Huh? Oh god! Uh, <laughs> this game. Before? Is there something on there we can look at? No, no. Haven't we been? I don't recognise none of these places. I don't know about you. Jesus! Ooh, another dead body. Oh Christ! Oh Christ! That guy. That guy's probably still right here with us. I mean, you die on a ship, your ghost stays on the ship. Come on. Oh, he's giving me goosebumps. Oh, let's keep going. That way. We can look at him though. What do you think happened to this? I was guy? waiting for him to jump at us or something. Like that. I don't know. Looks like nothing I've ever seen. I don't know what the fuck this is all about. But we gotta keep moving and find Olsen. Now. A secret found. Oh, hang on, is that a doorway? Olsen? No. Well, let's go. Let the captain go first. What was that? What was that? Another picture on the wall, though. Oh, they wouldn't let us look. Maybe if we'd have killed him, we could have looked. Who knows? It's a dead end. It's a dead end. Oh, he's... He's going mad. We don't want him to have the gun. Oh no. Uh-oh. Okay. What just happened? I don't know. Find the others. Do we want to go around the corner and see where he went? There's a torch in his hat, but where's he gone? Hey, what? Come on, we should keep moving. Right, let's go and just check in here. That's what I wanted to see. That's what I wanted to see. What the hell is that? Premonition unlocked close quarters. All right, where are we going? Oh, 
Oh, which is X. Try again. There we go, we got in. We need to find a way up on deck. We need to find a way what on deck. We haven't got the distributor thing cap though, have we? Well, this looks nice. <sighs> that can't be a good sign. What was that? Be oh no. Alright, <sighs> uh, we've got a big room to so have a little look around here. I was going to say, who's humming? There's something there. Clipboard. Flip it over. What do we got? Watch stand there. Reed, Miller, Davis, Perez, Griffin, Patterson, crossed out O'Neill. Strictly no unauthorised entry to guarded areas. Do not leave post until you're relieved by oncoming watch stander. Okay. So this was what they were guarding? Oh god. Alright, let's get out of here. <laughs> let's get out of here. <laughs> oh, I really don't like that. Alright, something over there, but let's go and check this side first, because he's going that way, so... Gotta be something to... Oh, it's a dead body there. Oh, a knife. Nice. Or is it? Bearing updated. See, we're with the guy that the premonition show got stabbed and we've got a knife now, so... Don't know whether this is a bad sign or not. Here. Jesus, what happened down here? Can we not search anything? Yeah, we can. We just have to go around dog tags. Let's see who it is. See if I found Charles T. Perez, Rex Perez, uh, Belvedere, Boston, Mass P. I think. I don't know. Boulevard. All right, let's get going. Oh, God. Oh. Hey, are you sure you know where we're going? We're on our own. Uh, Fliss? Hello? This is getting creepy now. I mean, it's been creepy all along, but this is getting Fliss. nasty. Fliss! Where'd you go? Check the body. He's got a bullet in his chest. Are we really going to pull that out? Mad. Music's kind of changed there. Uh... Right, we've gone a different way now. All these hallways look exactly alike. They do. Hey. Fliss. Hey. Where did you come from? Where were you? Something weird going on with there. Everything keeps giving me chills. I've got goosebumps everywhere now. Fliss. Fliss. Just walked off. Where'd you go? Hang on, we just weird. Okay, we've just done this. Oh, but this time it's got a name on Alex. Huh. That's weird. That looks like brand new bullets as well. Uh, 
Alright, right, what's going on? We kind of like hallucinating or something. The doors just shut and she's not there anymore. Are you absolutely sure? Oh God! So I'm gone. Something strange is happening. I can't see. Gotta get out. Again. Is it going to be the same name again? It's not letting us look this time. Hey, slugs. Oh. All three of them this time. We're definitely got to be hallucinating. Definitely. Oh, we're in the hallway again. Are you sure? So creepy. Find a way off the ship, yeah? How can we get off the ship? But it's like Groundhog Day. All right, there's nobody there this time. The bullet's there, though. And loads of blood. Oh! Who? Is that his brother? Wait him, wait him, wait him. That way, nah, bro, that, that was some creepy hallucination. That's a different hallway. Thank God for that. This was like some proper ground up day stuff, that. Find you doesn't find a way off the ship, okay. Ladder. Can we check anything else? No, you gotta go up, gotta go up. It's a bit of a small gap there. Right, anything to check in here? What we can? Why is he walking so slow? Here we go. We can. Can we get out this door? Yes. Yes. Right, that's where we just come from. Oh. Who's there? Who's there? Get away. Right, we can drop down there, but there's something to check over there. And I want to go the other direction as well, Skeletons. make sure. Skeletons. Skeletons? Just a piece of paper there. Internal memorandum. So first officer, say you asked to be kept informed of the radio situation. We attempted outgoing messages at the following times with no response. Secret found. We were able to pick up indirect messaging traffic until 0140 hours. However, there has been no further incoming messages track at all since that time. It is possible that our radio equipment is faulty. I'm investigating and expect to be able to report back to you by 3 o'clock in the morning. Private Cooper. And we can check that one up there. You're not supposed to be out here. I'm not supposed to see this. No. Sorry, you were invited now, right? Right, there's more places to check up here, and we can drop down, so let's just do this first. That door's locked. As expected. Come on, can we walk a bit faster? Oh, what was no, that? No, I'm not hearing this. I'm not hearing this. Let's 
got the creepiness right in this game, hasn't it? Definitely. Okay, so we've gone all the way around now. We've got that gate that takes us back where we just come from, and we've got the way to drop down on this side. Oh, we're going to jump on that. Julia? Oh, oh shit. No. Oh, that's a long way down there. Oh, God. It's horrible. Horrible, horrible, horrible. Find the others. Okay, so I just want to check behind us, make sure there was nothing there. Is this where this guy was before? And we were having a little ground dog day kind of thing? Looks like, doesn't it? Whoa! <laughs> oh, you can walk. It is. We're seeing ghosts. A bullet on the floor. No, but there's a body. It's a different body. There is a that's an old bullet that's been hit something. Okay, let's go. Ah, God. He's not really dead, he's not really dead. Save Brad. I don't think it's him, but save him anyway. <laughs> God. Right, I think that that is going to be the perfect place to end it because I'm not sure how much more of that I can say. <laughs> My heart is pounding, I've got goosebumps everywhere and it's been fun, it's been loads of fun. But everyone, thank you so much for watching, really means a lot. If you are new to the channel, if you want to see the rest of it, please hit that subscribe button. If you enjoyed the, if you enjoyed the episodes, hit that thumbs up, pop some comments down below, even if it's just a hi, an emoji, anything, just to boost the algorithm a little bit, you know. Well, yeah, thank you so much, and I'll catch you all in the next one. See you soon. Bye.